Well, everyone, I'm pretty sure you can see that I'm not riding a bike today. And uh, instead, I'm walking in a winter wonderland, you might say. Check it out. It's like giant Whoville trees. Whoa, 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 whoa. It's crazy. Well, winter has come to Canada, and uh, pretty much riding the bike is out of the question now. And um, just heading back to the house after work and hoping that there's something good on the table and then I got a call and said I had to come see a buddy and I guess he's having problems with his place his uh his tents are all oh, oh. there's the kids kids the kids are out playing in the snow making a bathroom so, they're busy. Anyways, we got the tents going. So let's check out. This is what you do in Canada when it snows a lot and your house is buried. You down there, Gordon? Nobody's home. They won't mind if I jump in and have a look. So, above ground. Right? Above ground. And then to avoid the bears and everything else, you go underground. Underground. Oh yeah. You see? Oh. So, we can fit the whole family in here. Oh, yeah. There we go, that's probably easier. How's that? Nice. It's pretty spacious. There's no cable, obviously, because that runs to the house, which is another probably eight feet down. But you can, um, you can fit the kids in here, and your wife, and uh, you if you want, you can dig a little out for the dog, but it's um, it's pretty nice. Block that door off down there. And uh, just a candle in here will heat it up nice and cozy. And you can uh, ride out the this big snowfall so you can get down to the house. Anyways, I thought I'd show you that. The kids are out playing. They should be out here digging their room, but... Oh well. All right. We'll check out the fire pit. There they call them penny stoves. Look it up on YouTube. Look it up on YouTube. Okay. What are you making down there? Bannock in a in a shovel? Yeah, shovel bread. Nice. We've had shovel dogs, now we're having shovel bread. Nice. Yep. On the next camp, you can wrap the dogs in the shovel bread and cook them on the... We are going to be doing that later. Oh, nice. How are things down there? You look like you're uh, steaming up pretty good there. Apparently, I was wetter than I realized. Yeah, I just checked out your uh, chalet. It was pretty impressive. I didn't realize it was that big. Yeah. <laughs> it's like one of those uh, natural caverns. Yeah. Yeah, and it's actually shrunk. Down. It was bigger yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess uh, I think it's stand up in it before. Oh, wow. That did shrink. Or Anthony grew. <laughs> All right, I'll check out this one first. This one's pretty impressive that they can get in there. It's tight. <laughs> What's that? You want your yeah, it's true. I'm surprised uh, Nathan got in there, really. <laughs> well, I thought he he might. Does he kind of make a lot of noise doing it? Like, ugh, ugh. Yeah, he usually makes a lot of noise. 
<laughs> Look at the, the essentials. The fridge of pop. I don't know if you can see the moon up there or not, but it's going to be a clear night. It's going to be cold. I'm going to show you uh, one of the scouts has a shelter made up here. And it's a trench that you cut deep into the snow and then you cover it. I hope the, I hope the light can catch it. If you can see it, it's covered with uh, branches and, and evergreen boughs. And then they've got a tarp over the front. Are you decent down there, Travis? What? Are you decent? Uh, sure. That means your butt's not hanging out? Nope. All right, cool. I'm just gonna show the inside of this right there. Shine your light to the back of the back of it for me there. That's crazy. So you're pretty comfortable last night? Yeah. You didn't die, that's a good thing. <laughs> Alright, you ready to go to bed? Yeah. Alright. If I uh I'm not gonna come check on you tonight, so if you start getting cold, you know, you start getting the shivers like this, you know. I, 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 you know, that sort of thing. Okay. Then come and knock on the door and we'll, we'll get you hooked up in the other, uh, the other tent. Okay. Okay. We'll see you later. Okay. Night, night. <laughs> so this is what I woke up to this morning. Oh yeah. No snowshoes on this morning, so I'm trying not to fall through. Oh yeah. I hope the light is good enough with the uh, the hero, but the snow has a slight. Just a slight peaky, pinky tone from the sunrise over there. And it's pretty awesome. It's not too bad out this morning. It feels like it's about minus, uh, I don't know, four, five. Probably can't see him, but there's mountains. That tall tree, you can see that strip of, of white, of brighter light. Right below that you can see the mountains heading up the island. All right, I gotta take a picture here for my Facebook people. Let's see what's a good photo here. I kind of like this one. Those trees there. Rule of thirds, rule of thirds. Nice. The crazy thing is, I think we have reception here. Anyways, I'll let you guys go. And you'll get one more over here. Here. Let's get one more over here. I don't know why I'm whispering now, because I'm far enough away from people, but... Try to get the... Alright, time to go. Go back to my nice warm tent and have some breakfast. Kim out.